followed him all night long. And with a guy with such a, a long reach over you, you know you cannot just sit there and just follow him all night. Or you gonna know what you know what's gonna happen. You're just gonna be a, a, a punching bag, as they call it, and just sit there and receive punches. And he did that all night. But for the have skills, I mean, I'm, I'm really and, and then really just got me with Ruiz. It's not so much what he did in the ring. That was a big factor for me, what he did, because, you know, but also what he said as well, because, you know, as it was going in, one thing we was I, I, that I mentioned when I was doing an interview, you know, on TV, and I was telling Ruiz, like, don't get comfortable of this. When he won, I congratulated him. I said, don't get comfortable, you know, with this. So congratulations, but don't get comfortable with the lifestyle and stuff. Uh, you know, because it can grab you. It, it can it can grab you. And, but, you know, you're just beginning. There's more. There's more to this. It can be more out here for you and your family, bro. Absolutely. Don't just dwell on this. You can, and that is exactly, and I said all that to say this. His last, his ending remarks was, you know, they were you're like, oh, I ate too much. Yeah. And, and I could have trained a little bit harder. I'm like, what the fuck you talking about? That is the exact opposite of what it takes to get. That's the opposite of how you, of what it takes to become a champion. What do you mean? But you was telling the world, you was telling us as you're training, that you, you're not letting it get to your head and all that. Oh, how it's such a blessing, and it is. But you can't come and say the opposite and then say, but the rematch, the third place, I promise you I'm going to get in this gym and train. I'm like, what are you talking about?